Letters Word says, mm -hmm. for a theoretical Stormlight live action adaptation, yes, it seems like it would be difficult to accomplish filming outdoor scenes while eliminating any signs of plant life that would be completely out of place on Roshar. Yes. Would you be open to changing elements of Roshar's ecology to make adaptation easier? I would not have to do that considering the budgets that we have been regularly offered. <laughs> uh, we can digitally remove plants. Uh, and so, um, I mean, the real answer to that is we digitally remove some the, the plants uh, and that's expensive, but that's what we do. You can film, there's some places in Southern Utah that we can film that are gonna look real good for the Shattered Plains. And then the other places that we would have to film, we can do volume stages for mm -hmm. or things like that, right? Uh, I don't think it's as hard to do as you say. The bigger issue um, we uh, have discussed when some people have been pitching on Stormlight Live Action is the spren. How many spren mm -hmm. do you put into a scene? Those are pretty expensive as these things go effects. And how much are we gonna use? And how do you adapt that? Uh, and how do you not make the spren look like Looney Tunes with mm -hmm. someone getting hit on the head and stars spinning around their head, right? Mm -hmm. um, which is not, you know, we all imagine them not being that. Yeah. Uh, but you got to make sure that it works. Um, it is, you know, like a lot of what's happening in the spring is pretty surreal. Um, you're getting things uh, that, you know, yeah. And so how, how do you adapt that and what's our budget for that? Those are questions that have come up. So, I, uh, I hear you, but we, uh, the budgets that people are discussing um, for Stormlight live action, if I do it, would make it so that we can do these things.